shut it down when I'm pulling up. Come around when I'm pulling up. In my town and I'm pulling up. Ready for anything, anyone. Know that I get it done. In the bands, I be pulling up. Tell your friends, cause I'm pulling up. Ready or not, I be pulling up. Remember, they said I'm not good enough. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Phoenix Suns franchise on NBA Live 19. We have got a worthy opponent opponent in the number one seeded Sacramento Kings here in the Western Conference Finals. Can we get back to our second NBA Finals in a row? It would be interesting. I would love to see it, but the Kings are blowing us out right now. Oh my goodness. Well, that's to be expected when they have a man named Kevin Durant. They've also got Marvin Bagley, Buddy Heal, Jonathan Isaac, Willie Cully Stein. They've got a lot of good role players there, as well as Marcus Smart. They are killing us right now. Look at this. Over 20 points. We're going to jump in. We jumped in at the start of the fourth, down about 18 or 20, something like that. We've got it to three, and there's a nice bucket for DeAndre Ayton to make it a one-point game. Now it's a three-point game again, and Finney from the corner going to tie this one up. Thank you, Chris. Then... King stolen by Booker and Devin Booker going to get this one inside to Casey McCoon who's going to give us a lead. Now a tie ball game with very little time left. Kings moving the ball around. No more time. Ball gets thrown up and it is no good by Bagley. So we are moving into overtime. Now we simulate a good portion of overtime, but we're down a good po a good bit. We get that to within four points and Booker going to nail a two-pointer to cut it in half. It is a two-point lead for the Kings. They are trying to get this one inside on us. Not going to go. Good rebound by Aiton. Kicked out to Mikal Bridges. Bridges gets that thing inside and gets it down for his fourth point of the day. And a tie ball game. Now just over 40 seconds to go in this ball game. Kings trying to work it inside. They do, but no good. And Aiton with another board. Casey McCoon runs his way through the defense and dunks it down for the two-point lead. Now a tie ball game. Not much time on the clock. Could be a buzzer beater. McCoon got it for three. Three-point lead with one and a half seconds. Bagley takes the final shot, and it's no good. And the Phoenix Suns come into Sacramento and take the Kings to overtime after being blown out through three quarters. And Aiton with 28, 26 from McCoon. Just a, a crazy game all around. 28 for Bagley, 21 for KD in this one. Happy to come out on top in this one on the road. Now we move on to game number two, and this one's looking bad for us also. The Kings held the lead pretty much this entire game, moving into the fourth quarter again. And as you can see, we're down 20. Booker gets us down to 17 points. Now Walker going to get it inside. It is down to 15 points just like that. And then Booker with a big time three is going to get this to 10 points. However, still 10 points, and Booker going to get it down to 7 points, but we never got past that point. So a 115-104 to 104 win for the Kings. McCoon, our leading scorer with 25 points, 14 boards. Great game for him. KD had 32, 11, and 10, a triple-double for him. Hard to beat the Kings if KD's going to play like that. So we'll move on to game number three, the final game for this episode. See where we stand after three games. Will we have a lead or not? As this is our first game in Phoenix, and we take this one quite easily. A 17-point victory. Aiton had 16. 37 for Kawhi. Thank you for waking up, Kawhi. 27 and 15 for Casey McCoon. McCoon has become a huge part of our offense. Do you like that? Let me know in the comments section below. How do you think the rest of the series is going to go? Let me know that as well as dropping a like and subscribing if you're new. Plenty more of this series and others coming your way.